Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome. I'm glad you guys here. Matthew. Oh, there. hey, how's it going? <laughs> well, yeah, back. It just appeared out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. <laughs> so, what we're going to do here is let Rashad take us on a little tour of his apartment and look at all the good stuff that he has. So, let's get to it. This right here, this stand-up, I actually got from Matt, he brought it to me. That was very nice of you, Matt. Yeah, well, I look out for my hips. <laughs> he was going to throw it away. I said, and Matt was telling me about it. I said, yeah, I'll take it. So I brought it home, and I had to use it as a display. It's very nice. Yeah. On the back side, it used to be for Gillette. I guess they did the thing for Rogue One. Oh, um, I see. Yeah. And I was kind of thinking I might put movies or whatever, yeah, yeah. whatever in there. That's and awesome. And I got this Star Wars canvas right here. I got these at uh, was Target. They had them on sale for like it was on. I think it was on clearance for like uh, ten bucks for the both. I'm gonna walk on over here and get a little shot of these. Same thing with those right there. We I got, actually got some of the Avengers, and then we got ourselves some. Star Wars goodness. Now right yeah. behind you, Rashad, it looks like you have some more Star oh. Wars goodness. I just now noticed that Yoda sitting there. Oh yeah. That yeah. is that is pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, I like that. It's, it's like like these like actually my favorite right here. These two, these three right here. Yeah, yeah, those are those are okay, but you know, Oh Yoda. But this this right here really stands out to me. <laughs> so I like the uh, I like the Star Wars Empire Strikes Back. Yeah. Empire Strikes Back, probably my, my most favorite Star Wars movie. Yeah, mine too. I, I think it's probably everybody's it's favorite. favorite. It has to be. I go Empire, Jedi, and uh, New Hope. And that's in my order. Like down it. here, I'm seeing a uh, little, little classic. Oh, yeah. A little, little Robert Zemeckis film uh, known as Back to the Future. Oh, yeah. Big Back to the Future. They, they, you cannot have a McFly. Fly. Yeah, but well, I like this. I got this at uh, Vintage Stock too. I like that uh, Chewie aiming down the barrel of his. Oh uh, yeah, bowcaster. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's badass. Yeah, I like that. And I got the Dragon Ball movie. Dragon, Dragon Ball. Ball Z. Everybody loves a little Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, uh, a little Force Awakens Stormtrooper. Yeah, Force Awakens Stormtrooper. I like that right there. You got my pole. Now, yeah. is everybody like me? The redesign of the Stormtrooper. I actually uh, like that one. I'm yeah. telling you, yeah, yeah I, like they, I think they look sharp. I yeah, like the way sharp. they they redid the stormtroopers. Yeah, I like that one. Very nice. Yeah, you got another Batman uh, little canvas right there. <laughs> got a Walmart. Uh, I'm loving this uh, Detective Comics yeah. canvas. Yeah, I like that too. Yeah, that is nice. Uh, this Batman, and I think I want to say that's the '80s. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, I it think was, that uh, was uh, a January issue of whatever year. Yeah, but I'm I'm thinking that was a uh, Batman circa 80, 80 something. I, I I'm not going to try and pretend that I actually know. Yeah, what year that was? But well, if you look up that that number, right? Tell yeah, you, number four eight seven. Yeah, probably but tell you where the year. It came his costume, uh, Batgirl's costume, and Robin. I'm I'm. I'm, I'm pretty sure you're right. You're right. I think it is the '80s because I think they change it from the, you know because remember the Adam West had the right the little bat. I think this might be late '70s, early '80s. Let me uh, go ahead and get a close up here on your little Street Fighter. Oh yeah, I got these at Walmart. These was like cast 90, metal, cast metal. Yeah, like ninety-eight cents. Yeah. Ninety-eight cents pop. Yeah, they they got other licenses. They I'd, got. I'd buy that for a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, they got other uh, licenses. They got Disney characters. They got Marvel, DC. But this is the ones I just gravitate to. Yeah. Very nice. Yep. Very nice. Okay. Let's, let's, let's gravitate over to gravitation. <laughs> the, uh, the this this nice piece of of oh. Hulk. Oh yeah. Uh, nice panels with the. Uh, You're talking about there's nothing there. It's just the Hulk. <laughs> Man only sees the Hulk. 
Yeah, for twenty dollars, this is a hell of a piece right here. Yeah. My, my programming doesn't mean doesn't allow me to see anything other than the Hulk. <laughs> I am the Hulk. That's, uh, that's Nothing can West harm me. Knows, Nothing can beat me. Generally speaking, that's uh, entirely accurate. Accurate. Excuse me. Yeah, that's a nice piece right there. I like it. Like it. Oh yeah. Yeah, but uh, I got the Air Ross. Paid twenty bucks. Normal price, around sixty to seventy dollars. I like how. You know, that should, probably should be Rashad's game room. Yeah, I know. I it should be. Yeah. Like <laughs> Very nice. And I got this at uh, Bench and Stop. That I'm, is lovely. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna get a frame, like a bent frame. I'm gonna go put it on there, and make it look a little bit better. Vintage stock. If you guys have one in your town. Visited. Support them. Yeah. yeah. All right. So I, I see I see a white handled oh. blade there. What, what what is that? Uh, this is uh, from GI Joe. A friend of mine's Vince. He got for me my birthday about a few years ago. This is uh, Storm Shadows katana blade. GI Joe. Yeah, GI Joe. With the little. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Interrupt here. Your, your <laughs> <Hello>? <laughs> yeah, you were talking about the hilt. Yeah, the hilt. I mean, oh, the, yeah, uh, has a, the grip. I mean, he has a cobra. Oh, you can oh. see it. Yeah, you can see it. Oh, yeah. It's very sharp. Yeah, I don't want to stab his couch. Love seat here. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah. And what else you got over there? Uh, blade. Everybody knows. I'm a big Blade fan. Yeah. And well, yeah, this is Blade. It don't open like in the movie. That's if someone else touched beside the Blade. Check it out. I've got his paint sticker. <laughs> Blow your hand up and then like that. Yeah. I actually got two of them. But yeah, this is I wore. That's this. a nice back uh, harness for the sheath. Yeah, scabbard. Scabbard. Yeah, I wore this for Halloween. Nice. It comes with a little dagger. Oh wow. Yeah. That is cool. That's pretty cool. He's a dangerous man. Oh yeah, it's sharp too. I see. Uh, I see a little uh, green, green right Oh yes. Yeah, what, what is that? Uh, uh, it's a Hulk statue. I got it. Uh, I think I, no, I ordered this online off of Amazon. Uh, paid. It was probably like thirty bucks. That was back then. It should be around like I think like fifty. I see a friendly neighborhood Spider Man. Spider Man. Same thing. I actually wore these two at the same time. These are made by Diamond Select. They're PVC statues. Uh huh. So if you want to get into statue collecting, you want to start on a budget. These are Diamond Select, is, Diamond the, Select yeah. is the company for you, eh? Yeah. And they also do like uh, resin statues too. Like actual, you know, besides this plastic. They, yeah. But they're a little bit more up in the hundred dollar range, but still good. I saw a cable one I want to get. Oh nice. Yeah. I'm a, I actually have a Deadpool one. Oh from, yeah. From Diamond there Select. Yeah. Little yeah. little shout out to uh, Deadpool too. Yeah. Oh, speaking of Diamond Select. These Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm a big Nightmare Before Christmas fan. Yeah. You got Sally, Jack, the mayor. Uh, Beetlejuice was in the uh, Nightmare well, well, Before Christmas. Well, no, well, no, he's not. I just stuck him there because you know he's a, he's a troublemaker uh, like that. I'm just being a, <laughs> being I know. a smart ass. Yeah, I know. Uh, but uh, yeah, but um, since it's, they all fall in the realm of Tim Burton. Uh, I just I just stuck Beetlejuice right there. I got him at uh, Toys R Us. But yeah, these three uh, shot lock and barrel, they all came in like a pack together for like twenty bucks. This is made by Diamond Select too. For the price, it's real good. For three figures in one. Yeah. 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 Run us through these these other ones you have. Oh, these canvas. Go yeah. On the wall here. Like I said, I got these at uh, Burlington. All four of them. Uh, they normally each. I think it was like, say like thirty to forty dollars each, but since it was there, I got them all for sixty together. Wow! Pay sixty for all them together. So you got the the canvas and you got the, the holograms. Yeah, yeah, little holograms. I think I got that at uh, I actually got that at Ross. I don't know why he has Hulk in the 
corner. <laughs> Nobody puts Hulk in the corner. <laughs> All right, okay. so we got like the, the the Super Smash Brothers corner over here. Well, Nintendo. Well, yeah, they, well, I'm a big Nintendo fan. Nintendo and Sony, but Nintendo, I just love the characters. We got the Nintendo uh, Super Mario cereal right here with the Amiibo support for the Super Mario Odyssey. Never been open. Never been open. I actually got two. I ate one box already. <laughs> How was it? That was good. <laughs> Better than the ones they had in the 90s, I tell you that. But uh, got this uh, uh, Super Mario Maker um, uh, figure. I got this Adventure stock. He was $34. I bought Link from uh, uh, GameStop. He was 30 I was about to say Zelda. I didn't know what you Well, yeah, a lot of people, we say that, people get mad. I'm not Zelda. I'm Link. <laughs> <laughs> the game was called Zelda, though. Yeah, Legend of Zelda. Yeah, but Link is the... Link is Link. Yeah, he's the uh, hero. I got this at Toys R Us, this little diorama. Of That's Mark. cool. Yeah, I just decided to keep him in the box. You know, yeah, yeah, it had to better. do that with some things. Yeah. Of course, you see my little Star Wars. Everybody can probably hear uh, the leaf blower going outside. Yeah. <laughs> and right here, I got this. Uh, this is Yoshi's Epic Yarn. Yeah, no, not Epic Yarn. Woolly War, I'm sorry. That's a Kirby Epic Yarn, I'm sorry. But it came with this. The game. And come, this is the box right here. I pay. I got this at Target for 30 They have on clearance for like $30. Cool. Okay, and these things are called Pixel Pals. You can get them at GameStop, Targets, uh, I think Toys R Us might have it, but basically what it is, I think the battery's dead. <laughs> I used it up, I used it up already, I think it's more battery. Yeah, battery dead on that one. Kind of like that uh, little Pac-Man ghost you got down there. Yeah, I like that it lights up, I think the battery. Yeah, I'm getting out. Yeah, see. There we go. It lights up. I have to get batteries for all of them. That's remember. cool. Yeah. And this flagpole from the first Mega Man, right? Yeah, it was Mega Man, yeah. And this flagpole for the Amiibos, you put your Amiibo from the first Super Mario Brothers, you remember you climb up on the right. Right, yeah. Yeah. This is like the world of Nintendo right here. Well right here, they, these are. Yeah, let me get a little close up on your little menagerie of small figures there. Yeah, I want to get the, the five, I think the five inch scale figures too, to try and get them. But these are Amiibos right there, you can see right there. Yeah, yeah. Nice, very nice. Okay, and right here, I got this, it's like a, right here, this is a box, like a, what do you call it, a loot crate box? Mm -hmm. Right here, the Super Nintendo. But I got this at Walmart, they had no clearance, so I went on and bought it. Normally it's 30 bucks, I got it for eight. But it came with this bag right here. This little backpack, Nintendo Sweet. Back, Super Nintendo backpack. Came with that mug right there. Mm. Cool. This coffee mug. And these right here, this the NES Classic Edition and the Super NES Classic Edition. Mm. Those are the ones, like this, the NES Classic Edition, Nintendo, they didn't think uh, it was gonna really sell, so right. it, so they only made a limited quantity of them, and people was buying them up, trying to cop them on eBay for like two to three hundred dollars even. Jeez. Yeah, even they want people trying to sell this for ten thousand dollars. That's how crazy it got. But with the when, but Nintendo's actually gonna re-release this this summer, so people who didn't get to get it, they have a chance to get it. But the Super Nintendo, you can get it right now. At first, it was kind of hard to get, but now you can. You can get the Super Nintendo pretty easy. They pretty stocked up on there. Uh, what I was going to say is I like your little anime banners up there above the television. Oh, yeah. I got these at Adventure Stock, too. You know I shop at Adventure Stock a lot. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I got Dragon Ball, Bleach. All right, so run us through what you got going over here. Let's start with the uh, the Death Trooper. Oh, yeah. Got this at Target. This is one of the big figs. This is, I got this on clearance. He is nice. Yeah. He only got like, uh, I think, five points of articulation. You could just, you know, kind of move his head, arm, legs. Yeah, so I just use him. Yeah. Kind of like a nice statue. Yeah, a little statue, basically. I just, yeah. oh, let's have a look. 
this little just fine. That, that's yeah, that's what happens when you jack around with your figures. <laughs> that was leaving right there. It happens okay. every time. Okay, I uh, got my PS, original PS3, but zonked out on me. Oh, really? Yeah. So, but that's why I got the, I re bought the. It went out on me. I had it for when I, I got because I bought this when it first came out back in uh, 2006. It lasted two years on me, so I went on and bought me a um, the. the that new that only lasted two years, and then it crapped out on you. Yeah, but to then because Sony they put so much stuff in. They had the PS2 games. You play PS2, PS1, and it had like a card reader and all kind of stuff into it. And it caused the overheat. The heat sink came. Done so people they report it's called the yellow light of death. That's uh -huh. my Xbox mirror. I know you, the X360 had that red ring of death thing. Mm -hmm. That's but Sony, that was what they, they call Sony's the yellow light of death because the light we power it on it turns yellow. And hey, if you're not a fan uh, of Uncharted, yeah, and Nathan Drake, then I don't know what to say to you. Yeah, I love Uncharted. <laughs> I just what don't. is it? Um, uh, Nathan Drake, he's from a game called Uncharted. He's, what was that? It's like an adventure game, kind of like a Tomb Raider type. Oh, you know what? You know? <laughs> <laughs> he's messing with it. I was trying to incite some uh, <laughs> oh. a backlash. <laughs> How dare uh, you, sir? Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, these right here, these little uh, Mortal Kombat figures, it's made by Funko. For y'all know who Funko, uh, the Funko, mm -hmm. they the guys mm -hmm. who make the Pops figures. Mm -hmm. Little Pops that everybody collects. Yeah, they make figures too. I want, I need uh, Luke Kang and uh, Katana, and I have the all that. The you have the thing. entire set, eh? The set, yeah. Okay, right here is uh, Ninja Turtles. It's kind of like a Lego made by Mega Blocks, their version of Legos. Mm -hmm. But uh, but Turtles, I have to say Ross, pretty cheap. I think like three or four bucks. But normally they go for like 20 to 30. Same thing with here. This will crane. This is like the original. This is like the 2012 version. Why are they in the box, Rashad? I know. I need to play I, with your toys. I know. I need to get play more shelves. I need to get more shelving. We always have this argument. We always have this uh, <laughs> point of contention between us whether to play or not to play. Yeah, yeah. Whether to keep them boxed or, in Matthew's case, play with your toys. <laughs> to unbox them, yes. Yeah, I'm kind of half and half. You'll have to, you guys will have to weigh in in the comment section and let us know if you're an opener or a non-opener. Okay, so so what what's this right here? Those look like transformers. Oh but, yeah. But oh, those are what. Transformers really should look like. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, these are uh, these trans. They made as called uh, cold cast, cold cast or something like that. Uh -huh. um, but yeah, these are. I got these at Venture Stock originally on eBay. They go between. It varies, like say thirty to a hundred dollars, or even more than that. Yeah, yeah. But I got at Venture Stock. They had a good deal on like thirty, around thirty each. Yeah. I now I'm, I'm getting a Vol Voltron vibe from this uh, mechanical cat over here. <laughs> oh yeah, that's uh, Rab uh, Ravage. Yeah, he's uh, pretty awesome though. And he is not a bust. Yeah, I need a uh, Starscream. I had a chance to get Starscream, but when I went back to go get it, it was sold. Oh. Yeah, so I just have those three right there. Alright, so what do we got on the next shelf here? Uh, God of War, the game of the year. It just came out a few weeks ago. Kratos. I still have to get it. Yeah, this is the collector's edition. Trying to finish up Far Cry 5. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I need to get that too. Uh, but yeah, this is the collector's edition. Uh, this is separate. I bought this separate. This is a statue made by NECA. Mm -hmm. This is Kratos. It's got some wood. Yeah, he comes with a shield. The shield is right here. It's a little tab I, you pull off here and you just put this little slit and it just, it just stays on like that. Nice. How many points for articulation does uh, that bad boy has, have? I think it has 30. Ah. It has 30 for being his legs. Got yeah, he is uh, the exact... The detail got... Yeah, you got wow. the knife in there and everything. Yeah, 
That's exactly how mine is. Mine's just a so smaller scale yeah, than yours. Yeah. yeah, that's why I want to get that too. That's that part of the collection. But uh, since Kratos killed all the gods in God of War 3, now he's in the Norse mythology. Oh, he's going after the Norse gods, huh? <laughs> yeah, you could say. <laughs> how dare him. He has a son named Atreus. I like this little diorama. Yeah, here. that's the son of Atreus right here. This came with the collector's edition. You know, Sideshow has a statue out right now that is very like this one. Yeah. Although I'm doubting this one came with the Sideshow price tag. Oh, I don't know. There you go. Yeah. Nice job. But uh, Matt is helping me out considerably here. Yeah, it comes with the map of the... Uh... Came to the what, what are these right here? Oh, these are little figures. These are the, the dwarves that help upgrade your weapon. Oh, okay, so they go with the God of War stuff. Yeah, okay. on the, when, you, when you play the game, they throughout the game, they'll help upgrade your weapons. If you need upgrades, they'll fix it. And stuff. See. Uh, is this a PVC statue? PV, yeah, PVC. So, you know what? That is... What they can do with PVC these days. I know, so. and for the price, to save you money, if you just want to kind of start on a budget. Yeah. Yeah, and for the, the detail they got on there, I think it's a good, good thing. Yeah, Atreus is uh, drilling that dude right <laughs> in the cranium. <laughs> yeah, Atreus, he's pretty cool. Like now, uh, Kratos, he's making sure that other guy doesn't have a cranium anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, here's the map right here he came with. Uh, Oops. Sometimes I'm still getting used to using this gimbal and sometimes I go the wrong way with it. Oh, that's nice. A little map of, uh, I think is uh, Midgard. Not, that's not to be confused with Thor's Midgard. No, oh, it's the same Midgard. Oh, is it the same? Yeah, you go to different... We're, right? we're Midgard. Oh, well, we're in Midgard. Yeah, that's what this Earth is. Earth is Midgard. Earth yeah. is Midgard, yeah, so that's where... Asgard, Midgard. obviously, is and where... You know, but, Odin. But, it's, but it's their version of... It's their Earth. version, yeah. 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 That's basically what, in the mythology. I, I like not, not to be confused with Thor, I guess is what I was trying to get at. Yeah. Oh, well. No, I'm not going to say... <laughs> I don't want to give away too much on the game. Yeah, don't do it. Don't yeah. do it. Don't do it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Spoiler alert. <laughs> okay. And up here. These I saw at uh, Vintage Stock. I, I don't know what brand this is. I just saw it. I said, oh, it's pretty cool. It's like they come in three in the pack. These two. These three. the shelf, though. Oh, we'll oh, 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 I'm sorry. We'll I'll, I'll skip that one. Yeah. Okay, we'll come back. Continue. Sorry, I'm skipping the shelf. But yeah, the, I got these at Vintage Stock right here. And these I, I got a venture style. These are the He Man. These are uh, Lord's subjects. It's like a, those mystery box. You open yeah. it to guess which. Yeah. You know, that's what these two are. These are they didn't have nothing to do with these or nothing like that. Right. But and yeah, you got some DC. DC. Lex Luthor, Joker, Deadshot. Uh, Deathstroke. Deathstroke. Excuse me. Um. Yeah. Uh. Is this a power ring? Yeah. Oh, yeah. The Green Lantern. Yeah. Will. Does it, does it turn on? Does it no, light up? Right I now? wish. Oh. <laughs> okay. And uh, since we're up there, yeah. Look at that. Thundercats. Whole. Oh. They actually coming out with a new series on Cartoon Network. Oh, really? Oh God. I love the Thundercats. Yeah, but this is. And a lot of people just complain about how they look now. They look more like a Steven Universe type anime style. Oh, really? So a lot of people just complain about that, but you have to kind of think they're trying to cater to the younger younger kids because yeah, back in 2012, <coughs> pardon me, back in 2012 they actually did a uh, uh, like a re reboot of Thundercats, and like, it was good, but a lot of people just didn't get enough ratings, and the toy sales wasn't good, so they canceled it. So. Now I think later this year or next year they're supposed to come out a new version of Thundercats. They, they go, they gonna play on the campy side of the original. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. How campy it is, but a lot of people just don't like the animation style. Though. You even got a little snarf, snarf. Yeah, snarf. He actually came with uh, Tigra. No, uh, Lino. Oh, okay. And I got him at this place called. Uh, Toy Base 10. I don't know if you heard of that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, me and Craig, the guy we did Evil Knievel, we went out there. He took me out there because I never been. Craig Watson. Yep. And he, I went out. Oh, I, did, I saw that. So I had to pick that, get that. I think I paid like forty bucks for him. That's this retail. That's what he goes for retail anyway. Do they make a uh, old decrepit mummy Mumra? They actually got a Comic Con exclusive, which comes with the uh, Mumra, the the smaller version with him. Ah. Uh -huh. 
but he's a little bit more. But there's two more figures I need to get. It's Tigra, not Tigra, but uh, Pan Chitara. Chitara and Panthro. Yeah. But they don't make them, so they want like high, like over $100 for it. Just for those. And I only pay like 40 for these. <laughs> My God. But, but they don't make them no more, so that's the reason why they're up kind of expensive. All right. And uh, down to the skipped row. Okay. I uh, got... Uh, this uh, this is an uh, actual statue of polystone, I think. Uh, bees. That me. is very nice. I'm digging that. Kind of turn him towards me a little bit here. Yeah, so. Look at him go. Yeah, what's not to like about that? That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> yeah, I think I, I can't remember. I think I ordered this. Did no, you? oh no, I actually got Adventure Stock. <laughs> vintage stock. Yeah, I'll tell you, y'all, you guys. They got go. something for everybody. Yeah, there. you need to go there. I got him a vintage Wolverine. And then your uh, your namesake over here. <laughs> got the blade. Oh yeah, blade. blade. Yeah, I actually ordered these two online though. The blade and that little piece. Of the diorama thing. Here. Diorama. Let me get a close up on this diorama. Yeah, I ordered them online. He's giving it to him. Now what's this in the, there's, there's a little box back there in the oh, back. Oh, this? This is a Lego. Like, oh, a play, um, um, a mate, I'm sorry, it's not Lego. This, this is actually made by Diamond Select too. So Diamond Select, they cover figures, statues, little Lego. Mm, who is it in there? Oh, it's Blade and Punisher. They teamed up together, the Marvel Knights. Mm -hmm. They, this, yeah, they teamed yeah. up together. I just never mm. open it. I'm gonna come in tight on this beast and get a. Oh yeah, uh, you just gravitate close to the up beast. On that face. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm digging the, that beast. I mean, it's a very dynamic pose yeah. for one thing. Yeah. But then I believe that uh, it's just done very well. Oh yeah, I agree. The way they've got his hand, uh, you know, all the positioning of the body, the pose is nice. He's trimming those toenails. <laughs> Telling you what, man, he's he's got a, a nail problem. Go for a manicure. All right. Who well, we got in the back there? Yeah. We got some, we got some shit in the back there. Uh, we got, we got, it's we got a crowded there. shelf. I know. Uh, that's the uh, war machine from Captain America Civil War. I mean, not Civil War, but uh, Captain America Winter Soldier. <clears throat> uh, I think this is just an Avengers. Uh, uh, that's uh, Mark, there... Mark 27. I'm not familiar with that. They has. I, uh, they have so many. I think, like in Iron Man 3, remember they have so many different suits? Yeah. So I think it's yeah. probably one of them, mm -hmm. I think. But yeah, they came in the pack. I got that, Ross. I got Captain. Oh, there you go. Oops. Pardon me. Right. I'm sorry. Right. I got, uh, if you can see that, I got Captain America. I got him and Ross, too. Yeah, Captain America. Burn. The cap. Now, you were trying, uh, Explain that head again. There's a, I guess, a werewolf head and a yes, Captain America the, mask. Yeah, it's just like a wolf. I don't, I don't really don't know why they have that. I don't get that. That's what I'm trying to figure. I don't know if in the comic or they did some kind of. Yeah, I'm not a. Um, well, if they did, I'm not familiar with that story arc. Yeah, I think this is the onslaught wave. I think. Oh. I think. I think. Yeah, the Red Skull onslaught wave. I think. Yes. And yeah, flip it around so we can see that head again. Hey, look at that, he's got a dog head. Yeah, but this is the build figure. When you see this on top, the, oh yeah, Red Skull's wave, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. And that and that blade back there, he's the, uh, the new, the, the, he's the Marvel, the, the Stash, <laughs> I'm not Stash, but the Man-Thing wave. Oh. The Man-Thing. And then that's a very nice bust you got, of Mr. Blade. Oh yeah, I have that, I had him for a long time. Put me some light on that, sir. Look at him. Yeah. That's the comic book version. Of course, that's the movie version. Yeah. Mr. Snipes uh, did justice to that character. I liked it. Yeah, it's kind of hard to replace him. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And a little cowboy bebop going on. Oh, there. yeah, a little cowboy. I used to watch it on uh, uh, Toonami. Cartoon Network. Toonami. Yeah. Oh, that's, I love that show. I got the adventure stock too. So, the moral of, I mean, the lesson learned in this episode is adventure stock is a very good place to shop. 
The collector is brought to you by Vintage Shop. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, we too, bad we, too bad we can't get a yeah, sponsorship. Yeah. I know, exactly. Because exactly. we're sitting here doing a freaking commercial for them, right? Yeah, now. exactly. Okay, um, over here, Marvel Legends over here. Yeah, yeah go ahead and fix that. Yeah, we did that for no good reason, didn't we? All right. This is uh this is the group wave. This came out a couple years ago. I saw the targets they had on clearance. So they call it the group wave because Well, it's the villa figure. You see So the, there's a piece of group and piece each of one group, of them. Each one of them, yeah. And, yeah, and you gotta buy them all to put him together. To put them together. Yeah. All I need is uh, Rocket Raccoon. He has the head torso part. Uh -huh. And I need uh, Nova. I think he has the other arm or something like that. So what do you have here? Um, I got Iron Man, Drax, Star Lord, and Gamora. And which body parts are those? Uh, if you look, I, is think, a, I think that's a leg. Drax has the stomach, I think. That's yeah, the, yeah. The lower and So you got an arm, uh, an abdomen, and two legs, huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Almost there. Yeah. <laughs> Over here, it's like these uh, 3.75 inch figures. They come together. It's the Thor Ragnarok. Hulk, Gladiator Hulk and Gladiator Thor. Get a little glare on those, but I got them. Got it. Yeah. And that's the Mighty Thor. This is the series. Mm -hmm. The comic book. Executioner. Yeah. And the Enchantress. Behold my stuff. <laughs> Behold my stuff. <laughs> yeah. And right here, I'm gonna I'm change this because since it's kind of like the Marvel section, but I had this long before I had all this set up. But, yeah, uh, yeah. The Rogue One uh, poster. Everybody, uh, it, uh, thumbs up on the Rogue One. I liked it. I liked it too. My favorite joy now is uh, K2SO. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> I like yeah. that. Uh, Look at all those Death Troopers. Uh, yeah, that's right. the reason why I bought those big, big uh, Death Troopers. Yeah. Um, okay. And uh, speaking of the Marvel section. Okay, this is the, uh, I think what do you call it, one four scale? Or, well, this is 12, 12 inch figures. I uh, got Thor. You can, you can actually change the hands, the weapons, the head. You can change the head scope. It comes with different head scopes. You can change it. Got Black Panther. You can change this mask, put the regular head, same thing. Same thing goes with the Iron Man. Put Tony, Cap, change his head. Uh, Peter, you can put his head. Then, the regular, uh, without the mask? Yeah, mean? just, yeah, just, <clears throat> just, well, actually, it, his, he has a, you know, uh, Spider-Man pulls the mask over his mouth. Oh, so it's just, it's like Yeah, that? just that, okay. yeah. Like he's eating a churro? Yeah, something like that, yeah, yeah. I got the Hulk, he got two different hands. You can change his head too with the, like the, I guess the 60s version. Uh -huh. Look through yeah. it though. Yeah. yeah. That's kind of more the modern look kind of. Yeah. Oh, this right here I got at Barnes and Noble. It's a, it's a book. But I accidentally broke the. You hey, haven't uh, taken the yeah, was, seal off or whatever. Yeah. Back to the tour the cover. Expanding universe wall chart. Yeah, basically, it's you could put this like a big wall cover. It spreads out. That's how big it is. Um, how much uh, space does it? It's saying cover. I I can start from right here, go all the way across the living room. That's how big it is. It spreads out. Like it makes it's almost like a big rug almost. Wow. It tells you all the characters, their bios. It has a pull out. It's pretty massive. Wow. Yeah. I got it at Barnes and Noble. What'd that go for? Uh this was like I think they had this on cleaners on sale for like I think like fifteen. Normally I think this was like thirty or forty. Very nice. Yeah. I like the cover of it. Yeah, so I just use it for that. So. Yes, we're about to get to the best part of this whole shelf. And that <laughs> is Gladiator Hole. Let me guess, he's green. From Ragnarok, you got some light, Mister. Yeah, this is a uh, Dime Select, and I got a Toys R Us. Sweet. 
I need to get the Thor to go with the. Yeah, set. yeah. I need to get him. I take the uh, black suit Spider Man off. I could change his head to. He has one with Peter's face, like the symbiote is like finna go over his face. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm liking the. You wouldn't want to see that coming at you, would you? Oh, no. That's right. That's what happens when you make me angry. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, for budget uh, statues, Diamond Select is the way to go. Oh, it must be the gold, bro. Yeah. Okay. What do we got going in this next show? Uh, some more Marvel Legends. I wasn't going to get into it, but I saw it. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start collecting. But yeah, this is the other part. This is the bullseye. This is part of the, the blade uh, or the um, uh, man thing wave. Mm. Now I need Jessica Jones, uh, Nick, Jessica Jones, uh, Daredevil, Netflix Daredevil. Uh, who else? Oh, here is Punisher, Netflix Punisher. You can see Electra. Yeah. So I, I got these two already. So I just need the rest. They have build the man. Build a swamp thing. Well, man thing. Man thing. Excuse me. Okay, yeah. fine. Yeah. I paid regular price for it. Him and Blade. Like, I always get them mixed up, so I'm thinking. Oh, oh, oh I, as the, sometimes I do that too. <laughs> we'll, we'll let it slide. We, <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> the comment right. section might hit you up then. Oh, you yeah. know, God. Guardians 2, Not Star that, Lord. Anything but that. <laughs> uh, Guardians 2. Yeah. Uh, Star Lord and Ego. Ego his dad. Uh, got this at Target. They had it on clearance for 11 bucks. But this is a, normally a $40. Uh, set. Sweet. Okay, this is a new wave right here, the Deadpool wave. This is uh, Deathlock. This is the Sasquatch uh, build figure wave, but it's the Deadpool. Ooh. Nice. Where'd you get that? Same place? Uh, uh, yeah, Targets. I got, yeah, I got these two, at, all three of these at Targets. Okay. Uh, speaking of Deadpool, since the new movie is out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a little shrine going on here. But, yep. The uh, Weapon, uh, not Weapon X, but uh, X-Force Deadpool. <laughs> yep, yep. Um, pay regular price. Cable, got to pay regular price because he's kind of hard to get. Is he? Yeah. I mean, you can find him, but most of the time he, he'll he be gone. A lot of people like that version of Cable, the, their best representation. Right. Yeah. And uh, it's kind of like a John Connor situation from uh, yeah. Terminator. He's actually Scott Summers' son. Right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. He has a daughter named, what's that? Jay Summers or something like that. Mm, that's something it. Like that's that, his daughter, yeah. I think. So uh, that's still the Sasquatch thing. Going yeah, it's still yeah. Sasquatch. Yeah, you see so, that? Yeah. yeah. So his head right there. So yeah, it's kind of weird that he's uh, the son from the future. <coughs> okay. Right here, these are the Marvel Legends, the, the uh, twelve-inch figures. These are all the Deadpool's. Okay, this one right here. This is the GameStop GameStop exclusive. This is the uh, Weapon X Deadpool. They pretty much come with the same stuff, except for, I think, he, except for him. I, yeah, except, they, 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 they pretty much come with the same stuff. Except, I don't think he has a different head scope. I think that's the only one he has. But the other two, they have different heads. They have the same head scope. No. But this is the, like I said, the, this is the um, uh, X-Force Deadpool mm -hmm. right here. Yeah. And this is just a regular. Who are they made by? Oh, they all the Hasbro. The they all Hasbro, right? Is He's the big one back there? Oh no, no, this is NECA. That's what I thought. Yeah, yeah NECA. He has like thirty points of articulation too. Yeah, and he's a bad boy. Yeah, he's kind of heavy too. Yeah, I could change uh, his hands. The gun. I got to take the gun. I got the gun. You can take the knife and stuff out. For the price of NECA, because I paid a hundred and might as well say a hundred twenty for them. For the detail, the weapons you get, it's, it's a good price for a hundred bucks. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. And this is 
this is this this is his gun. Ah, uh, little mini submachine gun type thing. What is that? Let's see. I think it says this end. Deadpool's end. gun. <laughs> what is, I, can't, I can't read the uh, I think the it says there. this end towards the enemy. Towards the enemy. <laughs> Very nice. What's he got? Chim 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 Chimichanga. I got him holding the Chimichanga. And you can change his head. This is like his skull head. You can put it on here. Or just have a display up here. This, I never even know this was out. I got this at, I saw this at Ross. See, I get a lot of stuff at Ross, too. No, I knew that was gonna happen. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. It's like little, uh, it's like a set, little chimichanga set, but it had different positions of Deadpool. <laughs> no. I should have. I saw another one. I paid like seven bucks for it. I should have bought the other one. I could just open it, open it, and just keep this in the box. Yeah. And be like Craig, Craig Watson and have one boxed and one for display. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, this is, I thought these are pretty cool. I'm, I'm going to go look and see if they got any more figures besides Deadpool. I'll buy them. Down here, we got a little Deadpool, a little canvas art right there. This, I got it, of course, bitch and stop. Mm. This is like, it comes with a little keychain. Very nice. Yeah. Okay. I think I paid like 30, 30 for him. And these are these little metal casts. This is Lady Deadpool. You get, they almost kind of like pop price, like, mm -hmm. say like 10 bucks, nine to $10. Yeah. Lady Deadpool, regular Deadpool. And back here I have uh, Deadpool in the white. I don't know which version. I don't know if they try to say this is the, uh, X -Force. the X Force version, but just white, I guess. Yeah. Usually it'll be gray, but. Right. Okay, right down here. This is what I used when I was in, when I dressed up as played. Uh, air assault guns. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Got the little this thing, bro. I stuck it out here. As long yeah. as I got those orange tips on them. Yeah, I know. I, <laughs> and knowing me, I bet I go outside. <laughs> yeah. What are you saying? What are you saying, Blake? Yeah, I don't, don't want to get into that, but you know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is. Uh, I got that. Pretty nice. Yeah. This is uh I got this at Toys R Us too. NECA. NECA. Mm -hmm. See that's what I'm saying. For the price you pay, 30 points of articulation. I could change the head. And I got the what Matt uh Murdoch. Uh got you got this without the mask. Mm -hmm. I got one it also comes with like a mask he could hold in his hand. Oh, wow. Like like he's just taking it off. Right, yeah. yeah. I could change this, combine the his walking stick. Oh, wow. I could put it in here too if I want to. Cool. All right, what we got over here? Over here is from uh, Sin City. I keep forgetting uh, Bruce, is, Bruce Willis. John Hardigan. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And this is motion sensor, too. Angie Callahan, 19 years old. She grew up. She filled out. They make I take his weapons away. This is of them. <laughs> Need to creep outside. Take Get that parade away from him somehow and kill him. An old man dies. A young woman lives. Fair trade. Nancy Callahan. Yeah. But it takes a little long winded, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, take a close <laughs> from the But this is also NECA, too. Yeah, there you go. And uh, if you're wondering why Bruce Willis is such a strange color, it's because it was a black and white film. Yep. Now I need to get Marv, uh, uh, what's his name, his character. Uh, oh, uh, uh, I just had it. Rick Beaky Rourke or something yes, like that? Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yeah. Okay, is this Star Wars? I'm trying to beef up more of my Star Wars stuff, but this is, especially, I'm trying to get more into the Black Series, but these are display helmets with Kylo and Poe. Sweet. Wait a minute, so they have Kylo and Poe together? Well, just... Does they, that mean that they're, they possibly could be brothers? <laughs> what are you saying? Hey, you never know, <laughs> What are you saying? Let the theories ensue. Especially with Captain Kennedy involved. Yeah. 
all it might be. Oh my God. <laughs> Let's not get into the her. Okay. Okay, Bader and the Stormtrooper. People don't like her. <laughs> it was. <laughs> the Bader and the Stormtrooper. Same. I think it's more, they got, I think they got more helmets. I'm not for sure. And I got this from Craig. It's a puzzle. Um, the Clone Wars. Heck yeah. Yeah, Craig gave it to me. I think he just gave it to me. Right. Rashad's over here trying to trip on his Gryffindor. Oh, yeah. Rug. Gryffindor. Harry Potter. Yeah. Yeah. Don't trip over the Gryffindor. One day I'm going to get me a cough, me a dining table. I put some more. I can have some more uh, stuff up there. And here's another thing I got from Craig. Craig is, uh, he's one of my. Uh, that is awesome. Yeah, he's one of my guys I go to. He he go to a lot of toy shows. Yeah. And he'll say, hey, Rashad, I got to get you vintage stuff. Yeah, look at the age on that box. Yeah. What year did that come out? I think it's not really that old. It came out in, oh, 98. Yeah. It was still old, though, 20 years old. Yeah. This is another from Craig. Oh, oh, oh. This is, this is another I bought from Craig. Boys motion sensor. I took the batteries. Craig told me to take the batteries out just in case they don't want to ride. Right, yeah, yeah, that's always a good idea. Yeah, I got this from Craig. It's a motion sensor. Is yeah. that the same year, 98? Uh, seven. 21 years old. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I got these at Walmart for free. They were clearing them out. Yeah. This, the Infinity is a Disney game. It's kind of like, you can kind of say, Amiibo. Except for the difference with these, you can actually pull them in. Say like your character dies in the game, mm -hmm. you can just take another character and stick them onto like a little platform and you can play as him. Right. Just, yeah. But yeah, this is what, the, I just use it as a collect, just collect your figures. You know? I think they made more money with people wanting to collect the figures than they did with the actual game. game. You're right, that's, yeah. So I saw, I saw all these for three bucks, I said I'd take them. So, got them. What's the bad guys? Oh, Vader, Kylo. Wait, Boba Fett was a bad guy? <laughs> well, you can kind of say he's just, he does work. If you pay him good money, he'll do what he wants. <laughs> but yeah, here's the uh, Luke and Leia. Sweet. I just need uh, I think Craig gave me this Leia. Yeah. Luke and Leia. Luke and Leia. Come on, put it together. Just play it. I know, I know. My goodness. I, I need to get it. I need to buy play it. With, play with your toys, kids. <laughs> and this is the art. Was the artifact? The this is uh, artifact. Yeah, artifacts. Yeah. yeah, this is a Vader. I got the Avenger stop. He's on a magnet board. <laughs> He's on a magnet board that hold him in place. The, yeah. The base of yeah. magnetic feet. And got Ray and Finn. Okay, these two right here, I got it. Uh, Our cousins? Oh. <laughs> hey, hey <laughs> but uh, <laughs> but I got these at Bitch and Stop. They're like the Disney Elite Star Wars figures. I, I saw, so that's pretty cool. They have a they have a Rogue One. They have um, Jane Erso up there. I saw. It is on one. Besides them, I said I got them, but well, they're like twenty-four bucks. But for oh, the, yeah. these are highly articulated too. For the price, I mean, before you get to like hot toys, I think it's kind of like a little start. Yeah, yeah. Until you get, until you get into the high-end type stuff. Right. So like little diecast the models back there. Oh yeah, yeah. Got yeah, it. me too. Yeah, I got the. Um, you need to set those up. That'd be really cool if you can set those up, hang from the ceiling. I, I was thinking about doing that. You know, all you need is a Death Star. And you have yourself a recreation of the uh, mm. battle. Yeah. <laughs> Kylo Ren shuttle yep. or command shuttle. Yeah, that's what they call it. And over here, I got a Tie Fighter back up in there. Yeah. Like I said, once I get more shelf space, I'll, I'll open some of these. I got Pose uh, X Wing. I've got a, uh, a Millennium Falcon back there. Yeah, I've got a Millennium Falcon at home, but uh, I don't have any of the rest of those. Okay, and these are the box art. For the uh, Marvel Legend figures that you have uh, right over here, right over here. I think if you have a look, you see it kind of hologram. Can you see a little hologram in it? Uh, 
see how the hologram shows up on there. Well, I'm just saying on the color. On the yeah, that little yeah. Hologram. Yeah. It's crazy. I like the box art. It's yeah, nice. I know. I know. I like it. Yeah. This. And yeah. it's actually the figure itself on there. It's not like a like a picture or something that's right yeah it's not like a drawn comic book character you know from the comic books that's actually what their figures look like yeah. <clears throat> pretty cool okay. and these are another property made by Hasbro it's basically kind of like these things here but it's Marvel that this didn't take off either mm. I got this on I got this at Toys R Us I paid a dollar and 48 cents. Oh, wow. I'm a, I don't know if you heard the show. It's a place called Five Below. Yeah, I saw those at uh, Toys R Us when they were going out. Yeah. Uh, they had a, a MODOK, too. Yeah, I got them right here. MODOK. Oh, wow. Yeah, and the uh, Super Adaptoid. Yeah, I need uh, Captain Fal me, uh, Falcon. I need Falcon, Iron Man. Hulk and Hulk Buster. Those are the ones I need. Walmart, five bucks. A little cape. But I can say eventually once I get another shelf, I'll take them out of the box. Yeah, that's always a problem. Yeah. Shelf space. It always yeah. ends up being a problem. These I got that from Craig too. R5D4. Sweet. R5D4. Who is that, Rashad? <laughs> oh, is that that from uh <laughs> Well you should know though. He knows. I, I know, I'm just wondering if you know. Oh, it's from when uh when they try to sell that crappy crappy jewelry to Luke, he didn't it was Uncle Owen. <laughs> Here's the red one. Come on. Well come on, Red, let's go. Look. Hey, what are you trying to push on us? <laughs> well, that <laughs> I can't remember the quote, but yeah. Uh, these are force link. It's basically you put that on wherever fig wherever vehicle you grab, it makes the sound effects for you. Oh. Yeah. Instead of you doing it, it, it does that for you. Sweet. Yeah. That's what that is. It comes with a Kylo figure. Bringing too. the galaxy to life. Yeah, and also the figures, is has a sense to, if you hold the figure, it make quotes from the figures. Huh. Yeah. Now, here's what I want to talk about. I want to talk about these Ninja Turtles. Oh, yeah. NECA, again. NECA. Yes. Look at him. So put that sword right in your eyeball. <laughs> and uh, you can change his hands. Now, what uh, what version of the turtles is this from? This is the original, the, the 1990 Turtles. Yeah. This is from Tur Turtles 1. The original movie. Yeah, right. see, the Turtles 1. Yeah. From Turtles 1. The box is right down there. Always keep your boxes in good shape, kids. And I think this has... Play with your toys. 30 points articulation, I think. Yeah. But there you go. Then I like how detailed it is. Oh, it's got some texture to it. Yeah, I, I think I, pay, I like I said, they a hundred over a hundred dollar figure, like a hundred. I pay like a hundred twenty three. Oh, that back where the light gets on it oh, instead yeah. of above it. There you go. Yeah, that shell does have some good detail. Heroes in a half shell. Turtle power. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and uh, Raphael. <laughs> and that is who? Raphael. 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 Who's this? He's my favorite turtle. Raphael. And? And he's uh, Neca, of course. And who, what's, his, what's this one's name? Oh, Raphael. There you, oh, well, well, who's that over there? Then? That's Leonardo. Le okay, that's, yeah. oh, that's right. Name after, Come on, Raymond. <laughs> after the Renaissance <laughs> uh, artist. Yep. Highly detailed, like this. Master same, painters. Yeah, same price, around 120. And know, he carries the size. The size. They also come with a, a music. He well, certain, some of the figures come with different things. Like he, Leonardo came with the music canister, but they all come with pizza, of course. Yeah. <laughs> and Mikey comes. Michelangelo. He comes with like a pork rind bag. <laughs> <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> and Don Tello, I think he comes with like a 
wax on, wax that wax, curl wax. Curl wax. Yeah, I think that's what he comes with. But what is it, wax on, wax off? Well, not karate. <laughs> I mean, I was thinking, I don't know why I was thinking karate kid, but. <laughs> And what's uh, what we got down here? Oh, the, the history of the Mutant Ninja Turtles, TV Ninja Turtles. There we go. I got this at Toys R Us. I think uh, Playmates they was going to come out with uh, all the other turtles, but I guess this didn't sell well. But there's all the different versions throughout the history of the turtles. This, this is this is the one that really gets me right here. 1988, okay. the original TV series. Yeah, I remember getting. Yeah. All four of the turtles. I only had two. I had, uh, I think I had Raph and Mikey. I had all four turtles. I got the, uh, what was the the metal, the metal turtle's name? Oh, Metalhead. Metalhead. Yeah. Metalhead. I, yeah. I had Splinter, and then I had the van. Turtle van. The yeah. Turtle van. I had the chance to buy it, but he sold the Kings. Oh. Yeah, Kings won't sell it. To <laughs> but yeah, I remember having all those as a kid. And, I was always losing the the weapons. Yeah, and yeah. I think it was I think it was either Michelangelo or Raphael. One of them I ended up getting a second one just for the weapon. Oh wow! Yeah. But yeah, they was gonna do a whole I guess a series of the history of the turtle. But yeah, so far I heard they have a Raphael one, but I haven't seen it. But yeah, I got this at Toys R Us for fifty dollars, but they when they retail for like a hundred over a hundred dollars. <laughs> But they had on clearance for, uh, yeah, they had on clearance for fifty dollars, so I just took it. When I took it, one of the workers said, "Oh, you you buying it?" I said, "Yeah, sorry, <laughs> I think because he, I guess he wanted." It. But anyway, this is the comic book version how they first appeared in nineteen eighty uh, four. Of course, the animated series, but not accurate to the animated. Series. This is based off the this is the toy line right here. Right, right. This is the movie version. I had the movie version. I had Raph and Leo figure. They're, the figures are soft. I mean, the original, the skin is soft, having mm -hmm. lifelike, but for some reason, this one, they did this, this hard. And it's also missing the belt, I don't know why. Huh. This is the next mutation. This base is supposed to be like compete with the Power Rangers. They did the episode when the Turtles fought the Power Rangers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but they end up teaming up together, but God, it was a bad episode. They also have a fifth turtle. Her name is uh, Venus de Milo or something like that. She's a yeah. female turtle. My master, the Shaman Chang E, found me in your city's Chinatown swimming in a drainage ditch. There was a fifth turtle in the jar with us. Chang E thought I represented good luck and took me back to China with him. I was schooled in the internal arts and raised to replace him as a master shaman someday. You ain't a ninja? No. I am Shinobi. Oh, oh God, that was terrible. A lot of people hate her. <laughs> this is the reboot, the tw uh, 2003. That was real good. This was actually, they were actually closer to the comic book uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, version oh, of, of the story instead of, you know, Splinter, he's a rat learned, you know, he's actually, he wasn't human at first. He was just a rat and his master is Hamata Yoshi. Hmm. Well, okay. Uh, they had and this is the fast forward. It's like this kind of kind of like the second iteration of the of the of the 2003 version. They, this when they go to the future. And and right here, they supposed to have a. Well, let me see. They was actually gonna instead of the fast forward turtles, they was actually gonna put the 2007 CGI. Remember that one? Two, oh yeah. They they lost the uh, the master mode. The, the master cast it burned burn down, burn down a fire or something happened in China, so they wow. could they couldn't recreate the this what this is the that mold was burned down uh -huh. in the factory in China, so they couldn't re make a recast of it of the original, mm -hmm. so they just added they just put that in there of the fast forward of the I guess second third season of the 2003 version yeah. So they was gonna put this in, but they didn't have the they didn't have the uh, mode, like I said. So that one's from that nineteen ninety seven. They did the CGI movie. You remember? The oh yes, 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 yes. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Uh, that one was uh, that one basically labeled uh, TMNT. This actually, this is supposed to takes place after Turtles two. Okay. The, of the uh, live action, this is actually supposed to be the sequel of Turtles two. Cause Shredder's dead. Yeah. That's the one that had Patrick Stewart. Or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Some, yeah. It was kind of. It was. It was a great movie. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, but, but yeah. it was kind of. It's kind of weird. Kinda, yeah, yeah. They, they kind of pick up where Turtles Two left off. Yeah, and this is of course the 2012. Uh, one of the best ones. Yeah, because they they 
cater to all the, the nostalgia and uh, plus new stuff. And it's the Michael Bay one. That's the Michael Bay Turtles. That, that, uh, that, name, that, that name sounds familiar. Let me, uh, cut, let me cut that one out. Let me, let me get that sword up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Down here, got the NECA. NECA make bobbleheads. It's the Raph and Mikey. They, those are the only two they did of this um, version. They have other bobbleheads, but it's kind of, I don't really care for it. It's, a, it's made by NECA, but it's not as deep cartoon detail like this one. I kind of like that one better. What's that splinter from? Oh, that's from the original the, 80s, the 80s. The, uh, the comic book, the 84 or well, the well, 88? Well, the 88. Okay. Yeah, that's what that one's from. Hmm. Okay. I don't remember him being I don't remember him looking like that. That's, yeah. it's, been, it's been a while. It's been a while. That's what he looks like. Okay, but yes. Monopoly. The Monopoly, Turtles, I have an opening. Just have a... Yeah. Got some blood. That play. That's right. Uh, yeah. uh, Got the display. Have you got the point yet that Matt is an advocate of opening all your toys and playing with them? <laughs> That's why Matt doesn't have any collectibles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh, over here got these ghost got the Ghostbusters and the Heatmaster of the Universe uh, dinner tray. I bought from Craig. Vintage, original. Yeah, yeah. The um, the Ghostbusters is in really good yeah, shape. Yeah, that's real good. Craig kind of regrets selling it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not that the Masters of the Universe, oh, but you can see the age on it. Oh, yeah, yeah. But uh, you can't see any age on that Ghostbusters. Okay. And here's uh, the TIE Fighter. Uh, uh, I'm going to try to buy two more so I can have build like a, a fleet. A fleet that has Kylo's uh, squad. Yeah. That's Kylo's ship down there with the figure down there. Okay, I got these made by Funko. Funko's making a lot of stuff, but yeah, these like the, yeah. the vinyl version, I guess. And yeah. Comic Con, the fall of uh, Comic Con exclusive. These are normally like 14, 15 bucks, but this is 24 cents of the Comic Con exclusive. Oh, yeah. Okay. And these like little paper shaped things I made, that's what, that's what these are. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's cool. So, yeah. so you it's have. You have some that you pulled out and made, and some that you kept in the box. Yeah, because I uh, just wanted. So there you go, Raymond. Right? You, you can you can keep the collectible, and you can have your toys. <laughs> your cake and, <laughs> your cake yeah, and yeah, cake. there you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got the metal diecast, the Batman vs Superman. Got the Ghostbusters, uh, Peter and Slimer, Cap and Iron Man. Mm, nice. Got the Star Wars drinking glass, turtle drinking glass. I got those at Spencer's. Oh. Yeah. I got that at Target. Um, okay. Voltron. 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 Here we go. Voltron. Okay, these, I got the whole set of the, the Netflix series. I, got mm -hmm. the, I finally got the whole set of the Netflix series. All I need for the 80s version, this is what this is. I need the uh, red and the... Uh, green arms oh and these also and what's cool about these it makes sounds and stuff like that but what's cool about it wherever you place the uh when you combine them together uh it knows what uh comes next yeah yeah it knows what color you're putting in oh like, I see. Red, say red lion uh, uh arm. Yeah. yeah something like that yeah but yeah I, huh go ahead oh, i'm saying that's all i need i just need this the arms for the the classic and i have the whole Thing. Awesome. So up here we've got, uh, we've got more He-Man. He-Man. This is a chase, Merman. The chase, uh, that's what uh, Funko has, like certain limited quantities. Mm -hmm. I found that at Toys R Us. I just walked in here, I saw it, said, but here's the original version here. I don't know if you can see it down there. Yeah, I can. Yeah, that's the original, and that's the chase version. Pops, Pops, Ghostbusters. Is it just here. a different color? It's just a different color or different mood. How they pose them. Oh, okay. That's what chains yes. are. Okay, it got the hard cast hero. Uh, this the Transformers '80s. G Matt's favorite incarnation yep. of the right. Transformers. That's what I grew up yeah. with. Yep. G. They call them G One Generation One. Mm -hmm. Got the uh, the He Man yeah. variant and Skeletor variant. I have a little power. <laughs> <laughs> got the NECA Bo Robocop 
it's based off the video game. That's why it has that look to it, like the back of it. Like, <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, what the? Yeah. They also have a regular version, but this is made by NECA. <laughs> <clears throat> Pardon me. Okay, got Goku from Dragon Ball. Powering up. Got this at uh, Toys R Us. He was like $60. 60 bucks. Yeah. He's nice though. I That's like nice. Him. These Ghostbusters, Diamond Select, they make if they got an animated version of made by Diamond Select just coming out, I wanna get that. Oh, wow. And these are vinyl idols. The kind of like an animated look to them. Yeah. The Ghostbusters. You got Marty McFly. I need to get Doc. Oh nice. Yeah, he's back there. Great Scott! <laughs> got an energy drink, Ghostbuster. Uh, I had that for like five years, so there's no way yeah, yeah, I'm drinking that. Got a Rubik's Cube uh, Optimus Prime. Whoa. It's Rubik's Cube. I could change it and do all this. It's just the head part you can move around. Uh, but that's what it is. Okay. So we missed the. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm sorry. We missed yeah. the Stranger, Stranger Things 2 over here. Yeah, the I got poster. Some. We got some figures over here. Yeah, figures. I, uh, I just got these about a month ago of Dustin and Lucas. Now, they. the three more figures coming out for the year is uh, Will and uh, Mike and Punk 11 from season two. It'll be that version from season two. Punk 11. Yeah. So uh, put them right over here. That's the, that's why the spots in the year. I'm gonna have those other three figures. They come out in the third quarter of this year. But, yeah. Well, you know what, everybody? I would like for you to just get a 360 degree of this uh, alleged apartment, which we all call a toy store. Yeah, there's so much more, but we're running. <laughs> yeah, he does have more to go. But you know what? We can always come back. Yeah, get an eyeball full of all that. We'd like to thank Rashad for letting us come into his home, his toy store. His toy store. Yeah and uh, walk us around so everybody can see his uh, collection. Just like he was saying, he only got to show us about 75% of it. He's got another 25% hidden away that we probably could have looked at. But I hope you all liked it, and uh, let us know what you think of his collection in the comments down below. We're gonna wrap it up there. I appreciate you guys coming out, checking out my play. Video games play over here. Yeah. Everybody be good. See you next time. Like or and share. Yeah, <laughs> we're, we're out. Wow.